Well, if we look at it from a coach's perspective, no, X's and O's, yeah. maganda itong game plan ni Coach Villet, mm -hmm. and the players are executing it. Dito naman sa Petron, they are not executing anything. Uh, unfortunately, no, they need to get their act together. Baka diesel yung kinarga ng Petron. Oh, oh. <laughs> so ito nga, may kita natin sa court, Micah Morales in the scene. And of course, siyang unang si Seta pa ni AC Masangkay. So Dima gives the ball to Dana Henson. Dana Henson still kind of under the ball. But well, ito ang si Micah Morada. Short yung kanyang off speed. But before anything else, we turn you over to Chino. Coach Villetto Photon said that to be able to win this game, they should strengthen their defense on the net and on the floor. Dahil last game, they had zero blocks sa kanilang first set. And it seems na nakinig ang players kay Coach as they won that first set in fantastic fashion. Balik sa kanya, Chiki and Dex. Tama, kailangan talaga ng blocking itong top landers, especially if you've got Micah Murada. And if you just saw that play, nag-land sa front line yung bola ni Micah Murada. This ultra-fast spike is brought to you by PLDT Home Ultera, the ultra-fast LTE for a happy family. Yeah, beautiful cut shot there from uh, Micah Murada, not the veteran. Who uh, so I think, you know, aside from Cesc Molina, has still one of the prettiest arm swings to Micah Murada, Cesc Molina. Yes, I agree. And totally agree. I like I some, my spontaneous swing also, but I, I really don't like left-hander. <laughs> Hard to block, ba? Oh, kakainis. <laughs> Here we go. Ay sa Pontinias, narinig ka at sabi niya, Tex, o ito para sa'yo. Donut. Oh, uh, it's like hearing from the professor, no, sitting beside me. <laughs> How often do you have an evangelist and a professor side by side? That's right. <laughs> so, and, that's zone six that you kept mentioning when you called the other game, no? Yeah. Yung din, yung pa rin. Sinid lang yun ni Aisy Masangkay. Di makulangan run sa play to the middle. And of course, Alamagos delivers zone 6 ulit. Yan. Ito si Micah Murada, again, guilty of kneeling before getting. Lahat kayo mga players ng volleyball, you have to get that ball first before you hit yes. the floor. You know, I think that's one of the weaknesses natin, mga Filipino players. We, we just kneel first before really sliding and getting the ball compared to the imports that we had. It's not a no ball dice. So now without any effort. Uh, eh, you see Aisa Maisa Puntias with a really nice angle. Kaya na kayo is itong makaliwede. Tingnan mo yung angulo na yan. At ang angulo niya ay brought to you by Ultra Fast Spike by, again, this Ultra Fast Spike is brought to you by PLDT Home Altair, the Ultra Fast LTE for a happy family. Nicely done there by CJ Rosario. Or was that Bang Pineda? Oh, Bang Pineda on the second option hit. No? B-Tress yung kawag na play. Maganda ikot ni Bang Pineda. Bang Pineda. Eh, sino mo, veteran to si Bang Pineda. Kita niya where the blockers were coming from. So, pumihit siya sa zone 1. Nicely done. Di makulangan sets up. Adjali Araneta, syempre, high percentage player, cross-court hit. Walang nagawa si AC Masangkay. Oh, right. Such a cerebral player to si Adjali Araneta. This ultra-fast spike is brought to you by PLDC Home Altera, the ultra-fast LTE for a happy family. AC puts that up, goes to Pontilias, but Araneta was there. That was a good hit by Oren Dain. Ang taas tumalon, malakas ang kamay, beach volleyball player. Narinig mo, we heard that Coach Billet. Oh, ano sabi? Nung pa-approach si Patty Jane Oren Dain, sabi ni Billet, go! Ah, ganda may coaching talaga. Kaya pala perfect yung timing. Yan din, perfect yung timing pag matangkad. Halos hindi na tumatalon si CJ Rosario. Oh, si Dimat. Uh, mas matagad yung kalaban mo, huwag mong sabayan sa talon. Di ba? It should delay siguro, I don't know, maybe a half a second or yeah, point, a third a of a second. Oh, you, you have to really think about soft blocking na. It's an easy over, chance for a play for Petron. That's a good first ball. AC sets up CJ Rosario. Kaya lang outside. Oh. She ran out of court, no? Pero almost alas 12 itong palo ni CJ Rosario. Oh. The NCAA standout from Arellano. That would have been a great play had that gone in. So Salamagos is up to serve. Ito matindi ang service niya. Nakaredi na ang defense ng Petron. Let's see if they can adjust to her serves. Yes, Jen Reyes, of course, gets that ball up. Yung set ni AC, masyadong malamit para may back pinada, but she did something with it. Oh, well, you know, the GNP system no, of every hitter, no, gawan mo paraan. Correct. 
Pero itong si Orendai, kita mo na kay Chip Chen, nakatirik na yung kamay, she still stayed out. Ano tawag mo doon? GN? GNP. Correct. Nako. Yung mga ating LDR. Alam mo yung LDR? Long Distance Relationship. <laughs> <laughs> okay, di pa kolangan set up for this, but Agada was there. AC goes to Bang Pineda. Look again, wants to play for or in the in or in the in gets the point once again for the top landers. Yeah, Patty Jane or in has got AC Masangai's number this far. Not in a check ball yet to death. Oh, smart player, kasi nga naman mas malit si Masangai. Kung may dadi ko na. Here we go, Patty or in the in. Serves the ball. Bang is there. Michael Morada will go. Well read there by Angeta Baquero. That's right. Well, the, uh, making meets me for AC Masangkai's block. And now, once again, nauna ang top landers. The first technical timeout, 8 to 6. And we are back. At the shout count, sports5.ph and captains, Aizen Marizo Pontilias against Angelia Rayeta. Nung una, medyo malaki ang lamang ni Pontilias. Be heard through shout, pumunta lang sa sports5.ph at hanapin ang shout widget para magparamdam ng suporta sa inyong mga PSL idols. We are back in action. That ball from Ortiz went wide. So now you've got Bang Pineda up to serve. Bang Pineda has a really strong arm. We were able to listen to that technical timeout. Sabi ni George Pasco, ano? Uy, anim kayo dyan. Hati-hati inyo yung court. Oh nga naman. Zone zones nga naman yan. So protect it. Oh, stay, stay in post, no? May, may poise yan. Eh. There's a position you know, that they want to run their defense at. Just to maximize court coverage, to put you in a position na makakadepensa ka. That's right. Sabi nga niya, babagsak at babagsak yung bola, basta nasa pwesto tayo. Ano ba nangyari doon? Tex, Ay. at yung bola ni Micah Morada, okay naman yung talon niya? Ano ba nangyari? Bakit mag-net? Uh, I think the set was kind of wrong and the timing was wrong. Okay. But there's a challenge here. Si Coach George is... Uh, well, he's making himself heard. Maybe we can find out later what this is all about. So in the meantime, <laughs> coming up with a play maybe for the next next set or the next run. You know, yung mga ganito, di ba? Chance na ng team na mag-usap sa court. Come up with plays. Time to encourage each other. So let's see what the challenge is. Kuminsan din ang hirap pag ganito, di ba, Tex? Kasi yung momentum mo nasisira. Oh, but it's, ano, eh, the onus is on the players. No? You, you gotta move around. You gotta stay warm. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. So let's see. Merong bang net touch ang photon. So Coach George, we're all waiting, eagerly anticipating for the result of that challenge. So very quiet. Ngayon, puro Petron ang nag-challenge. No? Ito, tingnan natin. Meron nga bang net touch. The ball hits the net. Well, na touch kasi nag-bounce yung bonus sa net. But for the arm of the top lander to actually hit the tape before no. the ball hits it, yeah. It's not evident here, no? But I, ako, the way I see it, wala ko judgment ng ating challenge manager. And as we wait for the judgment call, Let's smile nila muna ang top landers as I see their faces on the screen. That's Micah Ortiz and here, medyo smiling, smiling din ang ating triactive spikers. 
but you don't see any smile on Coach George's face. Because of course, after that first set, they sila with ending that set in 25-14. That didn't sit well with him. So he's doing everything he can, of course, in his powers to help his team earn points. So yan ang dapat gawin talaga. Habang naghihintay yung ginagawa ni Namayka Ortiz, yan, sumayaw ka, sumayaw ka sa court <laughs> to stay warm. Move around. Wag mapapako. Okay, what we were looking for, they were looking for the play. Okay. Which play that uh, George Pascoe was questioning. And we are still searching. So while we're searching, our players are in the court talking. You know, both teams, ha? Parang they're having a good time. All smiles. Itong top landers, all smiles talaga because ang ganda ng performance nila sa first set. At itong second set, eh, maganda rin ang tinatakbo nila. Yeah, Petron, at least, you know, with a better showing here. Hmm. Eight to seven lang ang, uh, uh, one point lang ang deficit nila. They're starting to defend a little better. Which yeah. is good. Oh, oh, but, you know, kailangan gawin naman ang quote ng top landers. You have to hit Petron while they're down. Wag mo silang payagan magkabuelo ulit because right. we know what Petron is capable of. Yes. Talaga naman. Alam mo, sa sobrang paghintay natin to get the the action na talagang kinakwesyo ni Coach George, tatanungin na nga sana kita, kailan ka ba nag-start mag-volleyball, Lepex? Ano, ano? ano? In the year of our Lord. <laughs> <laughs> o, oh, nga, sige, kwentuhan mo ako. <laughs> kwentuhan mo kaming lahat. Ay. Middle hitter, you're, you jump really high. Uh, uh, about 30 pounds ago. <laughs> and then, uh, well, I started in grade school. It's like any, anyone else. No, not like anyone else because most, you know, well, a lot of the volleyball players I know here at the PSM, late them and start. No, third year high school, they were just college. Ang tawag dyan, mga gifted. Oo. Ako, manufactured ako. Tingin ko ako rin, 10 years old ako nag-umpis eh. I went through a long process before I was able to really play to a level na na okay na okay naging effective naman na ako ng Diyos I had coaches that really did chaga with me thank God for coaches that's where we get our basics that's where we improve our plays here on the screen we have Coach George yan tsaka yung coaching style yan for all you younger volleyball players yan ano coaching style is just a coaching style don't worry about how your coach says it, but yeah. be astute enough to know what he's saying, diba? Don't listen to how he's saying, how he's saying it. Pakinig, pakinggan nyo kung so ano it. ang sinasabi. Yeah. Niya. Wala naman niyang... Kahit namurahin ka, no? Hindi naman siya magiging... time natin, diba? Oh, I, know. Know. I cannot say what I was called for one year, oh. no? When I got to USD, no? Pero, bottom line is, he made me a good player. That's right. And the bottom line in that challenge was it was unsuccessful. So now Di Makulangan goes up to serve. Did it affect? Did that long lull affect her service? No, it didn't. AC Masangkay, Mina Ganon, Patio in the Ian. Oh, again, Araneta with a good hit there. Walang nagawa yung floor defense oh, ng Triactive Spikers. Nakita ni Araneta, no? Michael Morado, a little late on the pivot. Doon niya dinaan, kaya yung tapo ng bola medyo side spin. Kaya because Michael Morado's momentum was still closing. Yeah, kaya dapat talaga tinitingnan mo rin yung speed ng mga blockers mo. Eh. Pero bigla namang bawi si Michael Morado. Yan, yeah, Henson uh, caught jumping at the same time. Nilambiti ni Michael Morada, one of the talented jumpers we have, no? Matagal din sa area, pero nagsasahing ng kanin yan habang nakatalon. Ate yan. Nako! Napakalayo ng service ni AC Masangkay. Kailangan bumawi ito with a good play. But now Michael Ortiz gets a chance to earn a quick point for the top landers. Good serve. AC sets up a ganon. Ooh, nasa ilalim siya, no? Ang pangit ng tunog ng gol, eh. Uh, tsaka late on the wrist na. Yes. Uh, parang service yung trajectory. Tapos yung katawan pa niya facing outside. So, of course, where your shoulders are facing, chances are, di ba? Mm -hmm. 
Doon pupunta yung bola. Good first ball from Jen. Pontillas. Saved by Henson. Easy over by Ortiz. Back Pineda. It's Musangkai. Pontillas with a power hit to zone 6. Ang ganda ng set ni Si Musangkai right in the wheelhouse of Isa Maiso Pontillas. And this ultra fast spike is brought to you by PLTT Home Altera, the ultra fast LTE for a happy family. Ace here for Michael Morada. Nice serve. Ang Kenta Bakero just a hairline fracture late. Ito pa rin si Tabakero always accepts a challenge. So Michael Morada gives it back to her, but this time she gets it. The set goes to Araneta. Montilla sets up. Mina Agarmon! Smart move! Oh, anything you can do, Mina Agarmon, I can do better, no? The donut hole dito naman sa side ng photon. Parang medyo napako yung floor defense ng top ladders dun sa bola niya. Di makulangan, sets up Henson. Van Pineda sets it. Pontinas again gets that score. The team captain that she is leading the troop. And so, meron tayong timeout. The score is 12 all. Ito pa naman Petron, pag binigyan mo ng ano, chance ito, eh, they will really grab that. So, di makulangan goes for a combination play. No go. Pontinas sets it up. Ang ganon. Pinaglaruan yung blockers ng top landers. Sinek po ni Mina Ganon. Sabi niya, uy, joust yan. Don't soft block a joust. No? You have to get, get in there. Tulad ng power tips natin. No? Yeah. You have to be aggressive. You have to get there first and wave them into the court. Si Micah Murada, kahapon pa to. Titigil, matitigil na ba ng top landers with the play? Not at this time. Napaka soft ng hit ni Dana Hens. And I think she remembered she's a backliner. Maybe that's why she did a soft touch. Oh, pero I mean, well, from a coach's standpoint, if I were coach, we'll add, tapon mo na sa likod. Correct. Again, hirap na hirap pa rin sila sa service ni Morada. So a chance for a play dito sa Petron. AC, of course, gives it to Pontilias. Napakasok ng hit ni Pontilias. But Tima Palaman was not in the right position. And as we head to the second technical timeout with 16, Petron up. 12 for Photon. Welcome back dito sa PLDT Home Altera Philippines Super Liga 2016 Invitational. Ako si Chino Luis Pio. Passing and floor defense. Yan daw ang piece of the game ng Petron, sabi ng kanilang star na si Isa Maizo Pontillas. They have to be consistent sa kanilang offense and execute kung ano man ang kanilang pre-nactice kahapon against dito sa photo. Tignan natin kung magawa nila yan and hopefully they can bounce back dito sa ating second set. Balik sa inyo, Lex and Chiggy. Itong si Isa Maizo Pontillas, talaga namang you put her anywhere, she can deliver the point. Oh, I mean, you have to really give you know, kudos dito kay Isa Pontillas and he, also Angeta Baquero, no? Uh, both of them assuming different roles. They're making Isa Pontillas run middle attacks also. Mm -hmm. And then Angeta Baquero, yes, she has a shoulder injury, pero tignan mo, she still finds her way on a court. That's right. Ang sabi nga niya sa akin, eh, sometimes she doesn't even think na meron na na-dislocate na yung shoulder niya. Pagdating ng bola, ipapancake niya yan kung kailangan. So, warrior in her. But still, ang um, top landers, eto, humahabol na paunti-unti against Petron. So, they have to put a stop. Kung hindi, the momentum will totally be on the top landers' side. I think Petron needs to get the set. Dana Hanson, Again, that play to Pontilias. Di makulang and sets up Araneta. Bampineta gets that ball. Mina Aganon with a hit. And a blocking error there by Shirley Salamagos. Salamagos late on the pivot there. No? She got caught kind of below the net. Nandun yung kamay niya. She tried to do her job. In fairness to her, no? hindi lang niya nagawa. But uh, you gotta wave them back into the court. You just That's right. Nagahabul ka, you're going to keep your hands still. They're going to tool you all day long. Nice cut shot Ooh, for Mara Fanny James. Oh, nga. Ang ganda sana nung save. Kaya lang, instead of putting that ball up, yung save ni Masangkay na palayo pa sa net. 
This ultra fast spike is brought to you by Miyamiki Homo Therna, the ultra fast LTE for a happy family. Mina Ganon, good first ball. Mashado mababa yon para kay Rosario. Di makolangan sets up. Arden the Ian. And that ball goes out. Hindi to mama sa blocker sa net lang. And then the ball of Palabas. Now we're going to have a substitution here for the top landers. So Araneta takes a seat. And the double sub, no? Putting me Makatuno as the back row center. And uh, Dawson, no? The FPU Tamarao, Lady Tamarao. Slap into the opposite uh, spiker position. Tignan natin sino mag outside dito. Sige. Ah, Dawson's going to stay out and Orinda is going to play opposite. Fresh off the bench. That's right. I think she was a little under the ball. That's why Lumabas is holding wrist action. So, Pontilias again. Good serve. Sobrang ganda ng serve na regalo ni Henson yung bola. Of course, Rosario was there. Quick point for Patron. A good read there from uh, Tabaquero, but she, has, she had to cover so much ground. Uh, Pam Dawson no, kind of caught standing there. Sorry to point you out, young lady, but medyo nakatayo pa doon. Iuhulog na. Wala na ibang magawa yun. Eh. That said, the Makatuna was a little bit too close to the net for So Kulang, there goes the serve of Pantilias. Nice first ball. Patty gets that ball, but does not go over the net for Sanchez. Well, clear naman, uh, hindi convincing yung... Uh, uh -huh. Yung touch. Sasabihin ba nila touch? <laughs> si, ano, si Dawson, eh, it would have been... Ang hirap kasi pag substitute ka eh. I mean, you have to perform when you're put in. Yes. And that's why you get substituted because the one that you got that you substituted was not really performing. So Correct. you've got to do a better job. When, uh, this uh, substitution may be to warm her up for the next set. I don't know what's maybe, in uh, yeah, Coach Billet's uh, mindset dito. And that ball lands on the line by CJ Rosario. Layo na takbo ng bola, si Jay Rosario, good timing, no? Na, nakapihit siya. Pero di naman hindi masyado pumihit yung balikat niya. You let your arm do the traveling, kasi pag sumama yung balikat niyo, you run out of court really quick. There you go. Kanina kasi yun ang naging problem niya, diba? So it's good, she made the proper adjustments. Yumi Yonko here, gonna serve for Petron. Yonko with that serve, short one, Patty was there, Makatuna sets up, Micah Ortiz, save ni Bang Pineta. Makatuna sets up, but nakuha pa rin ang Petron, Pontilias tries to put a stop, no. Okay, here goes Patty or in the in, but Nina Ganon is there, Murada sets that up, Bang Pineta tries it but no go. So Dawson, wala pa rin. Boy pa rin ang bola. Maika, Morada, napakalakas ng bola niya. Nang sagot pa rin. Ball stays alive. Makatuno goes to the open hitter. Hinabol, nasagot. AC Masangkay goes to Bang Pineda. At walang tawa sa zone 6. Hindi nga ganun kapilis ang bola. But of course, a donut is always the best way to put the ball if you want to win this set. And that's what happened. 25 to 16. Petron taking the second set.